Oh, hey, hi. I'm Crazy Chris, and welcome to So Cool Science. Science you can do right at home. I'm just looking at the night sky tonight and going over today's science file. How did the universe begin? Try this! You will need a balloon and a marking pen. Okay, first you gotta get yourself a balloon. Uh, now I know there's one around here somewhere. I, I saw it earlier. Okay, you, you guys see a balloon anywhere? Anywhere? <laughs> On top of my head? Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, that's pretty... Oh, uh, you also have to get yourself a pen. Ha <laughs> ha! Blow the balloon up, and then, using the marking pen, put dots all over the balloon. Okay, take your polka dot balloon, and you're going to blow it up. Here's what you do. Put your finger on a dot that's further away from you. And then, blow the balloon up like this and watch how fast the dot moves away from you. Okay, now you're going to do the same experiment, only this time put your finger on a dot that's closer to you. Now well, that is so cool! Did you notice that the dots that were further from you moved away much faster, and the dots that were closer moved away much slower. Now what's going on here? How does this polka dot balloon mimic our universe? Well, take a closer look at this. The universe was once an extremely compact, dense, and hot singularity, or single point. About 13.7 billion years ago, this singularity had a cosmic explosion called the Big Bang, and the universe has continued expanding and cooling ever since. American astronomer Edwin Hubble provided some of the greatest supporting evidence for the Big Bang Theory with his 1929 discovery of proof that the galaxies were moving away from each other. Hubble found that galaxies further away were moving away proportionately faster than those closer, showing that the universe is expanding. A balloon is a good way for showing the shape of our universe as well. Most scientists believe that if you were to set off in a rocket from one spot and kept going, you would eventually make it back to the same spot you left. Just like if you were to run your finger around the outside of a balloon. So now you know that the universe began with a giant explosion. You know, using a balloon to see the beginnings of the universe is why science... It's so cool.